Hey everybody, Dustin here, checking in, Hike Brothers Outdoors. I'm here today with my boy Dugan to tell you about the Chesapeake Bay Retriever and why it's better than a lab. Before I get too deep in this video, I should probably give a quick shout out to my cousin Mike Murray. Without his influence, I probably would have a lab, just like the other 10 billion people in this country. Is it possible that there's more labs than people in the United States? So the other day I was on a waterfowl page on Facebook. Someone posted and said, hey, post a picture of your duck hunting dog. And so I obliged with a picture of my boy Dugan. I bet you out of the 300 pictures I scrolled through on there, 290 of them were labs. Well, this video is not for you. This is a video about the Chesapeake Bay Retriever and why it's better than a lab. Like all conversations, I'll start this one with an icebreaker. In this video, I'm going to hit you with some facts and some of my opinions and the opinions of some fellow Chesapeake owners. So remember folks, this is all in fun. I'm gonna quote my cousin Mike with the best nickname for a Chesapeake ever, Pitbull of the Marsh. They certainly tear up the marsh. Labs tear up the marsh, too. If the marsh is the name of your couch cushions. Unlike the Labrador Retriever, the Chesapeake Bay Retriever originated in the United States. The Labrador Retriever, on the other hand, originated in Canada. Just like... Yeah, you guessed it, Justin Bieber. Let's talk mannerisms in the duck blind. Hunting with a lab sounds a little bit like this. Hey bro, do you ever, uh, you know, leave your lab in the truck and then just get it out at the end of the hunt to let it retrieve? That'd be cool. Hunting with a Chessy sounds a little more like this. That's right folks, nothing but crickets chirping. Calm and cool customer in the duck blind, that's for certain. Chesapeake's and labs are approximately the same size. Although you could make the argument a Chessy fills it out a little better, especially in the chess department. I'd say a Chessie is built a little more like Dwayne the Rock Johnson. Where labs are looking a little more like Joaquin Phoenix. But I bet every one of you watching this can say at one time or another you heard some guy brag about his 100 pound lab. Well, labs aren't supposed to be 100 pounds, and they're probably going to have a real hard time fitting that in the back of their Prius. As is the case with most breeds of dogs, Chesapeake's come in several colors. The main three being brown, sedge, and dead grass. Labs, on the other hand, as far as I always knew, there was three colors. Well, lately some more colors have been coming out of the woodwork. No longer is it just yellow, chocolate, and black. Now it's starting to sound a bit more like a 120 count box of Crayola crayons. Silver? Champagne? Where do they come up with this stuff? 
Labs aren't all bad. They do love people. They love to hang out with people. Chesapeake's like to hang out with people too. They just like to hang out with people who hunt. Lab guys will always try to tell you how great their dog is. Championship bloodlines this, championship bloodlines that. Oh, he doesn't have papers. This is how I really think it goes down. What do you got there, man? What do you mean? It's a charcoal Labrador. The guy I bought it from said it's a purebred. Champion bloodlines. Well, shoot, man. You thinking what I'm thinking? Yep. I got a lab. We should probably breed him. With Chesapeake's, it goes down a little more like this. These dogs would both be great candidates to breed. They both have health clearances, titles, great pedigrees, and great drive. Another great quality in the Chesapeake is they handle the cold really, really well. If your dog needs a vest in early October, you might have a lab. Unless, of course, he can fill it out like this. Lab guys, let's be honest, your dog never looked that tough in a vest. Hey everybody, I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, hopefully it was at least good for a laugh. Again, I can't stress enough, it's all in good fun. I don't hate labs, I'm not anti-lab. Hunted with plenty of great labs. Uh, they're just not Chesapeake's. But uh, a special shout out to the Chesapeake Bay Retriever Facebook group for providing me plenty of pictures and videos to help make this possible. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and shower you with some of those pictures here now. That way uh, you lab guys can print them off and put them on the wall. Your labs will have something to aspire to be when they grow up. Uh, thanks, guys. Uh, make sure you like, share, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Check us out on Instagram and Facebook. Thanks for watching.